Can anybody answer the question that we've been asking for quite some time? How old was Aisha when your prophet married her? Huh? Anybody? Come on. It's in the Hadith. Anybody want to give it a shot? Anybody? Are you embarrassed? Just tap your shoes and I'll count. How many of you know how old Aisha was? Several First of all, I'm not your brother. Let's make that very clear. I, I appreciate that. You know what? And why the Muslim people chop the head? Because of you. <laughs> because of me. Christian my influence. Christian. They've been chopping heads way before I was born. Way before I was born, Dad. Oh, uh, way before. Uh, yeah. Shame on you. Keep talking. You don't know Keep talking. Talking. I have a more respect than you about Jesus, okay? You reject him as the son of God, Dad. I have a Sorry to break it to you. Sorry to break it to you. You don't about Jesus. Oh, keep talking. Shame on you. We're going to be, we're going to see a picture of you in a newspaper that you bombed something with that attitude. We're going to see a picture of you in the news. Here outside the Islamic uh, Center in uh, Washington, D.C. It's D.C. Street Preacher here. And um, we're out here with the uh, Reuben and the gang. Try to get some footage of him preaching. So I'll start right now. Well, guess who's here? Once again, Jesus is trying to get your attention. The Jesus of the Bible, the Son of God, the Savior of the world. Islam is a lie of the devil. Islam is wicked. Your religion is the bastard religion. You despise Jews. You despise America. You ought to thank God you're walking the streets of America, not that sandbox you call home. Time for you to repent. Mohammed, <laughs> cursed be his name, was a pedophile. Your prophet was a pedophile. Wicked are you in God's eyes. Anybody want to answer the question we've been asking for quite some time? How old was Aisha when your prophet married her? How old was Aisha when your prophet actually had sex with her. Prophets in the Bible lived holy. And tell me what prophecy that Mohammed said that came to pass that gave him the right to be a prophet. Wicked, perverted, hellfire. I say, God bless our military. May they be Cupid and shoot you dead and give you your 72 virgins. Time for you to repent and obey the Jesus Christ of the Bible. Don't tell me you believe in Jesus. You don't believe in Jesus. You reject him as a son of God. Time to repent of your wicked way. Time to cry out to the real God, the God of Abraham, Jacob, the God you claim to know, but you reject. Time for, to, for you to believe in Jesus as the Son of God. Know the Jesus Christ of the Bible. He even died for you, Muslim, but you reject him. You reject him. The Bible says, honor the Son like you honor the Father. You want to honor God, yet you don't honor the Son. Time to repent. Here's an infidel right here. You guys are going to walk away from an infidel? What does your holy book tell you to do? You reject the God of the Bible. You reject Almighty God. You reject salvation only because your prophet is a murderer. You got a problem? Uh, 
public place so they can take your picture. You can take all the pictures you want. Let's talk about your religion. How old was Aisha? You don't know nothing. Uh, how old, tell me how question. old. Correct me. Correct me. How old was Aisha? Correct me. This is the way you want to no, discuss correct your religion me. with me, huh? Correct me. Thank you. Tell me how old Aisha was. Be honest. You don't want to say. Well, I want to say. You don't want to say. Look, look, I want to say. No, you well, don't want to you say. Show me, you show me one place that says Jesus is the Son of God. He is the Son of God. Oh, what do you mean? He God is, is like you God. and me can he go is the Son of God. with somebody? And that's what you reject. So, you see that? You reject Jesus as the Son of God. Wendy. Makes it very clear. This is eligible. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son. Yeah, I'd get out of there, girls. I'd get out of there. This place is a bunch of pedophiles. Wicked pedophiles. And you can't even answer how old Aisha was. You're embarrassed. I'd be embarrassed too. Seven years old when a 55 year old man looks at a seven year old girl and say, oh yeah, there's good marriage material. Something's definitely wrong with that. You guys have lost your mind. But what do I expect from a Muslim? Here's an infidel right here. Hi. Hi. Hey, what's going on? That's good. What's wrong? Uh, I was just, I have nothing against you saying, you know, things that, what do you think, you know? I just think it's unrespectful. I mean, I think Your religion's thing. chopping heads off and you want to talk to me about respect? I didn't finish to uh, talk to you. Can you are you shaking? Finish? What are you so nervous for? I'm cold. So, Give me a jacket. Come on, I up. think the best time to do what you're doing will be after our prayer. I tell you what, why don't you let me in there for five minutes? That'll be the best time. I mean, you want to do that? I think right now we are in the... Uh, you you know better no, than no, anybody. No, 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 hey, let, let him talk. Us. Why don't you give me five minutes and we'll pack up and walk away? <laughs> what I'm saying is that we are actually... Like, right we do that, we do that if you give us a five minutes in your chair. Yeah. Okay, let's do that. Here's our church. Yeah, right here. That. Yeah. This is our I'm church. I'm just saying, the best time to do that would be after. Because right now we are like in our... But you're not praying. The communion, you know? You're not praying. You're, you're just gathering right now. You're not praying. Yeah, but right now people inside, they are like getting into their spiritual... So they can hear this is what you're saying? I mean, yes, they are. Oh, thank you. They I, did, you. I, I appreciate that. But yeah, but I, that's, uh, I, I, I didn't know if it was getting through. I, it I is, really it appreciate is. that. It is. But Give I, me five minutes in there and we walk I away. I think this is you ten minutes here on the church. I can't believe you're respectful. When your religion's killing people like me, you want to talk respectful? I wouldn't talk about that right now, you know, but I... I'm just saying, you wouldn't like us to come to your church like before like the church prayer and being like screaming and no 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 you burn my thing, churches you know? down that's you kill so you would like us to do that so no we, that's what you're doing right now as you and I are talking uh, your religion's killing people I like just me. said what I whatever I had to say okay so, well I appreciate that right. Jesus Christ is the Son of God Muslims don't tell me you believe in Jesus and you reject him as the son of God. You people have lost your mind. Time for you to know the God of the Bible. Your prophet Muhammad is a pedophile. You want to lay down on your magic carpet and face Mecca and expect God to hear you? You want to bow down and kiss some black rock? You guys have lost your mind. But that's what I expect when you deny Jesus as the Son of God. You reject Jesus Christ. Why is it all your countries are cursed? Oh, they're nothing more than a sandbox. And yet you want to say Allah's blessed you guys? You've lost your mind. You've lost your mind. You need to cover your face up, woman. I want to tell you. You need to cover your face up right I now. Want to tell you need to cover your face up. This is why hair. you Muslim men and don't allow these women to talk. This. I understand now. I understand no, now. You need to cover your face. Church, Shame on you. Shame no on wonder you. they have your face Shame covered up. Go to your church and you pray. Nobody can do anything. No, your, your religion is burning our churches, woman. 
Your religion are, is burning our churches. Oh, hey, why don't you guys have a little courage like this woman here? Come out and defend your... How old was Aisha there, fella? Why you came out? Cover your face. Go get your husband. No. Go get your husband. It's shame of you. Oh, you don't know what you're talking about. No. No wonder you women, you Muslims beat your wives with a mouth like this. No wonder you women get beat. You are talking about Oh, your prophet Muhammad is a pedophile. Your prophet is burning in hell. He's burning in hell and rightly so. He's burning in hell and rightly so. No, he deserves hell and he's going to send you with him. Shame on you. Time to read the Bible there, people. Your prayers were in vain. We're not saved by works. There isn't one good work you can do to gain salvation. It is all because of the blood of Jesus Christ. And you reject him as the Son of God. Your religion rejects him as the Son of God. You can pray as many times, you cannot eat pork, you cannot do certain things. That's not going to get you not in heaven. You're going to go to hell for that. You're not saved by your work, Muslim. And your religion is known for killing people, murdering people, bombing. I never knew Muslims had blue eyes. When you bomb, one blows to the left, the other one blew to the right. We are respecting you. No, I can't. Why? I'm concerned about you burning churches. We stand out your mosque with a megaphone and you think this is hate? Your religion is killing Christians. It's childish. Your religion is killing Christians. Oh, it's not childish, it's wicked. It's demonic. But then what do I expect when Mohammed is a pedophile? Your prophet Mohammed, pedophile, child molester. Any, any Muslim want to tell me how old Aisha was? How old was Aisha when your prophet married her? Oh no. No. Your prophet called a person like you of color a raisin head. That's what Mohammed said about black people. Now you need to know your religion. What other religion tells you, kill the infidel, get 72 virgins? What other religion? Christianity, we try to bring salvation. We build libraries. We build hospitals. What does your religion do? Your religion burns them down. Your religion kills. That's why we have so much security at every airport. Because of your religion. Wicked religion. Time for you to obey God. It's obvious God, Allah, your Allah hasn't blessed your land. It's nothing more than a sandbox. A wicked sandbox. Nothing glamorous about your, your country. But then again, when you bow down to Satan, when you bow down to Islam, when you think Mohammed, a pedophile, is a prophet, you've lost your mind. I don't think you walked in with those shoes, pal. I don't think you walked in with those shoes. I think that's why Islam is a fast-growing religion. You get a free pair of shoes. Why, if you guys are so peaceful and normal, are they having to lock their bikes inside of the mosque? Something wrong with you. Here's an infidel right here. What does your religion tell you to do to an infidel? Huh? Here's an infidel right here. At least be more loving, and when you chop my neck, at least use a sharp knife. If you're going to chop my neck, neck off, use a sharp knife. Your religion right now are killing Christians, bombing buildings, all for your God. And quite frankly, if it weren't for America, you'd be destroying Israel. 
and many of you despise America. And yet you come here to take advantage of our freedom, our grace, and yet you spit and burn our, our American flag. Time for you to repent. At least in America, we believe, a remnant of us, at least we believe in the God of the Bible. We got a presidential debate, a presidential uh, candidate, whoever wins for 2020 puts his hand on a Bible. Not the Quran, not the Book of Mormon, a Bible. The same Bible that says Jesus Christ is the Son of God. Don't tell me, Muslim, you believe in Jesus. You believe in a different Jesus. Your Jesus is just a good man, a prophet. Jesus Christ is beyond a prophet. He is God's only begotten Son. God does have a Son. Jesus Christ, on the cross, died even for you. That's what Christianity offers. We don't need good works to save us. Your good works are not going to save you. You don't know the God of the Bible. And many of you Muslims want to come here and pray and look holy, yet many of you masturbate to pornography. Many of you are a bunch of idolaters, fornicators, cussers. You really live an unholy life, but yet when you come to the mosque, you put on a good face. You're a bunch of phonies and frauds. Your only hope is to kill yourself with suicide, and that's how you're going to have uh, an eternal paradise, having sex in your heaven. How wicked of a belief is that? You don't know the God of the Bible. There is no sex in heaven. You're not going to have a harem in heaven. Mohammed had his heaven on earth. And he's burning in hell, and you're going to be soon to join him if you don't repent. That's right. Wicked, wicked, wicked is your religion. Here's an infidel. What does your holy book tell you to do? You guys are a bunch of lukewarm Muslims. Is Islam kills more Muslims than any other religion. Your own religion would put you to death. You know I wouldn't be doing this if we were in Iraq. You know I wouldn't be doing this if we were in Afghanistan. Oh, but when you come to America, you lie. You pretend. You act like, uh, oh, we're just part of you. No, you're wicked. You are wicked. Shoe bomber, Muslim. Husband and wife that shot up San Bernardino, Muslim. The shooter that went to uh, the Fort Hood, Muslim. The one that just recently happened in Virginia, Muslim. Your wicked religion kills. Jesus Christ came to give you life. Big difference between Mohammed and Jesus Christ. Mohammed is a pedophile. Wicked in God's eyes. Time to know the Jesus of the Bible. Come on, Dad. Come on, Dad. Come on, Dad. You, she needed a good spanking. That's what happens when you don't spank your child. But then again, Islam allows you to beat women. Oh, is your religion tells you to beat women. Your religion teaches a bunch of lies. But when your prophet is a pedophile, I expect you to believe those lies. Time to repent. That's right. Oh, you guys think you don't eat pork? You think you do certain things? Works are not going to save you. Otherwise, Jesus Christ died in vain. Otherwise, the Son of God died in vain. Time for you to know the true Son of God, whom you reject. Your religion rejects. Hate to break the news to you, Muslims. But your religion is the bastard religion. Your religion came from a whore. Let's call a spade a spade. You reject the holy living God. How many of you actually hate Jews? You despise Israel. 
your religion would have annihilated Israel had it not been for America. That's right. You despise Israel. You despise the Jew. But you keep it to yourself. Time to repent. I'm at least honest about my religion. You're not being very honest about yours. Your religion will send you to hell. This is your wake-up call. Repent and obey Jesus. Repent and obey the God of the Bible. Obey God. And that is believing that Jesus is the Son of God. You reject the Messiah. You reject the Savior. You think Mohammed is your Savior. This is your wake-up call, Muslim. This is your wake-up call. Your only hope is to commit suicide, to go into your paradise, to bomb for your God. Have you lost your mind? Yes, you have. Whereas Christianity, we try to give you eternal life. We're not going to wrestle you, put you in a headlock, chop your head off. It's your own free will to reject Jesus as the Son of God. You'll pay for that. You'll pay eternity for that. But we're not here to bomb you for Jesus. Why would I want to send you to hell? By bombing your mosque. By chopping your head. But your religion teaches otherwise. Time for you to obey the God of the Bible. This is your wake-up call. Can anybody answer the question that we've been asking for quite some time? How old was Aisha when your prophet married her? Huh? Anybody? Come on. It's in the Hadith. Anybody want to give it a shot? Anybody? Are you embarrassed? Just tap your shoes and I'll count. How many of you know how old Aisha was? First of all, I'm not your brother. Let's make that very clear. I appreciate that. You know what? The why the Muslim people chop the head? Because of you. <laughs> because of me. Christian influence. They've been chopping heads way before I was born. Way before I was born, Dad. Oh, uh, way before I was yeah. Shame on you. Keep talking. You don't know Keep talking. I have a more respect than you about Jesus, okay? You reject him as the Son of God, Dad. I have a Sorry to break it to you. Sorry to break it to you. You don't know nothing about Jesus. Oh, keep talking. Shame on you. We're going to be, we're going to see a picture of you in a newspaper that you bombed something with that attitude. We're going to see a picture of you in the news. I have a more respect than you. Yeah, I'm fine. fine. He might need a little bit. He might. Yeah, you might. You might give him a little bit of water. He's on fire, dude. You are our guest, so you know we want to take it. Don't go. We take it as you bring it to us. We take it, right? And you said it. This is a guy with a megaphone, man. We're not bombing a building like your religion does. We're not chopping heads off. We're not pushing homos off a building. What happened to the Jesus that says when you go to someone else's prayer, please, let them pray with you. We already did. We let you pray. Yeah. No, I was sitting there and I was just hearing the whole thing. No. 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 Well, you were uh, actually, you actually, it's, no, it's, it's, it's illegal. It's illegal for us to interrupt a service. When your service was going on, this wasn't you going on. Five more minutes. No, no, this was. No. Everybody could pray in the peace. No. And then we come out and we hug you. Man. No, we don't want no hugs. No. 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 Wait, wait till June. Then go hug a homo. Go hug a homo in June. We know what you guys do to homos. Push them off the building. Okay, once again. How old was Aisha? Can you tell me how old Aisha was when your prophet married her? Your mother age. <laughs> what, do you, what do you have? What do you have hiding in there? You got any little uh, midget, ISIS midgets in there? What do you? What are you hiding? Your mother. Oh, I see. There is no God but Allah, and Muhammad is his messenger. Mohammed was a pedophile. Mohammed was a pedophile. Mohammed. Spit it out.
Put it in a piece of paper if you can't, if you can't speak it properly. What about them? We're not, we're not Catholic. Hey, I, say, I say death penalty to them. Anybody that molests a child, I'm in favor of, of uh, execution. That's right. As a Christian, I'm in favor of execution. But the crime's got to fit. And if I was around, your prophet should have been executed. That's right. Because she was seven when he married yes, her. That's right. Seven years old. Isn't that nice? Isn't that nice? What 50-year-old plus man looks at a seven-year-old girl and says, I'm going to marry you? No, you know what? If Mohammed were alive today, Mohammed would be on the Jerry Springer show. If Mohammed were alive today, oh, he'd be, he'd be, he'd be the Grand Marshal at a homosexual parade. Hey, dude, dude. I'm a Marist. Talk about disrespecting. Buddy, you're killing, your religion is killing people like me. A couple of signs of megaphones, that's disrespectful. What happened in Vegas? What happened in Los Vegas? Was that a Muslim? Yeah. The biggest mass killing in America. Who was Christ it? Church. Uh, it we don't know. No, I'm talking yes, about what happened. Right. Muslims. What, yes. what happened? If we, if we, if we right. add up all of the Muslim murders, uh, yeah, that surpasses. Right. Your your because religion will surpass. Will surpass what? All of the security that we have at airports didn't happen because of Las Vegas. Right. It was your religion. Was your religion. It was Muslim. There's, there's because all different of types of people in this world. Okay? But we don't. We uh, talk, the guy didn't hey, shoot for his religion. What about the black The guy didn't because shoot I'm just for his religion. Y'all raped them little kids and ate them people. When you're doing what? What about the kids y'all raped? The black slaves. Would you like to rape those slaves? Do we do that? You go to churches and you bomb them. You go to churches and you burn them. Come on, buddy. No, no, your religion. No, you raped them. No, your religion. Wait, how about hey, brother, God bless you, brother. And I hope and I hope and I hope you treat people the way we treat y'all. I hope you don't chop my neck off. Yeah. We never came to church. We never church. came to your We're talking, places. buddy. We're just talking. Listen, but you talk we're just about talking. Proof. This is we're, we're just proof. talking. Just no, 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 you have insults. Telling, telling the truth is not the truth. Oh, one Muslim? Muslim? Come on. You have provoked. Come on, you're, you're lying. Love, man. You're lying. God, you're lying. God could give you for what you're doing. You didn't see you any should of be us standing in front of churches. Maybe you should be insulting them. Uh, no, you'd be burning them. No. You'd be no, burning them. No, no, we don't stand there. There's no, the difference in the is what you're spreading. I love what's inside. Nobody's raping anybody. You must you must be one of those Farrakhan Muslims. No, no, no. I'm telling the truth. You don't like that. You don't like the truth. You must be one of those Farrakhan Muslims. I got people in the back for 1700. Buddy, don't bring race into it. What about the little kids y'all rape? Don't bring race into it. The black kids y'all rape. I mean, your prophet called black people raisin heads. Listen. Are you serious? What did you do with it? Are you serious? Look it up. Mohammed. Look it up. Mohammed says raisin hands. Come on. You don't know much of your religion. You can Google it. Go ahead and Google it. Prove me wrong, fellas. Anybody can protest anything. You don't even have to know anything about that. Are you looking it up? There's there's marriage material. There's marriage material right there. He came 1920. He not even a man. I am not with you. We're traveling. You're interested. 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 You're Free speech in America. Going to hell. Go to your country, Clown. 